Hi, I'm Denshi. It's me, your favorite Scratch YouTuber that doesn't even upload Scratch videos. And in today's video, I want to show you how I was blocked off of Scratch. So if, if I go to uh, scratch.mit.edu over here and try to sign in with my account, diamond.1234. Mind you, this is my account for when I was like, you know, I made this when I was seven, right, at school. And uh, I have been blocked, as it says so clearly over here, for seemingly no purpose whatsoever. I might have gotten a message in the past, you know, 60 days that I haven't checked because my account was blocked back in August and I haven't made any any content on my Scratch. I haven't touched my Scratch account since about March, about April. I think, yeah, about April because that was when I was planning my video for my, you know, my Scratch video with the projects that I made. Um, that video was uploaded back in May after I was done doing all those, you know, checking through all those projects and I haven't opened my account since that video. So I have literally no idea what, what I could have possibly done to anger the Scratch Jannies uh, who've now banned me off of Scratch. And, you know, I wouldn't really care if it wasn't for the fact that this was my eight-year-old account that I've had since I was a kid, you know, it's kind of messed up that they would do that. But I also haven't found any purpose for why they've actually gone through and banned me. If you go through and look at the page, there's a community guidelines page over here. They say, you know, respect people, be safe, don't you don't you know, don't don't dox people on scratch, give don't don't be mean in, in your feedback, leave nice comments, be honest and keep the site friendly. I haven't broken any of these rules and I don't I don't think I could have ever done anything bad, right? And what's even worse is I have 197 unread messages up there. Uh, you know, right over here, 197 unread messages that I will never get to read because, you know, my, my account was banned. Although I did have a lot of comments on my page and you can read those. Those are publicly available on my page. I think it might have something to do with that. Maybe one of y'all like sent a mean comment on my page and then I got flagged down with it for some reason, which makes no sense because I wasn't, I wasn't telling people in my videos to go and, and harass anyone or to go and leave bad comments on my page. So once again, no idea why I was banned. I don't really know why I'm taking this so seriously. It's Scratch, but you know, just telling y'all like Scratch Jenny is completely out of control, completely out of control. And um, another reason I'm making this video is if anybody knows of some actual like decentralized way to distribute Scratch projects, please do tell me. If anybody knows if there's like some open source Scratch website thing, tell me because that would be so cool to have as opposed to scratch.mit.edu that seemingly just gets, you know, <laughs> seemingly just bans people randomly out of the blue. So yeah, I mean, the Scratch Jannies finally got to me. I don't really know what else to say. I hope you enjoyed this short little video about my unjust ban, you know, justice for Denshi. If you're a Scratch administrator or whatever the Scratch people are, Scratch moderators, um, then I don't know, pop me an email, put a comment on this video or something, if we can sort something out, you know, you know, just between you and me, you know, figure something out to get this account back. But I mean, look, this is kind of upsetting because I wanted to make more videos about Scratch. Now I got to figure some other way to get a different account or something like that, because this is, this is really annoying that I can't use the same account again. And it's also my childhood account. So that's also kind of messed up, but that's it. Uh, I've been Denshi. I hope you enjoyed this video about me getting banned off of Scratch. Goodbye.